This is Joe Vec, Vic from CME Group here in Chicago. The wheat market was mostly higher here on Tuesday. We had some crop ratings out from USDA on Monday afternoon, and the ratings told us that we've got a big time problem in uh, the Southern Plains, Kansas and Oklahoma in particular, with some of the worst crop ratings in recent memory, I, I believe record lows in some instances. So the crop is being affected by a drought that's been going on for several months now at this point. We've seen some relief uh, to that drought in eastern por portions of, say, Kansas, Oklahoma, eastern Texas, but uh, central Kansas, western Kansas, uh, same deal with Oklahoma, remain very, very dry. We've also got a building drought in the northern plains. Uh, we've got uh, North Dakota, South Dakota, very, very dry, and then not a whole lot of relief in sight for really either area. So for the moment here, we've got weak ratings and a drought um, that is really building more than anything. So we've got crop problems and kind of a crop scare on our hands here. As a matter of fact, the Kansas City Futures posted some fresh uh, multi-month highs here. Funds have been big buyers of wheat. They're still a little, sh they're still net short the uh, Chicago wheat market uh, by just a little bit and uh, long the Kansas City wheat market by just a little bit. So we've seen some pretty active fund buying here. It will be interesting to see if the funds want to explore the long side of the Chicago wheat market. Again, Joe Vec, Vic from CME Group here in Chicago.